everyone I'm going to share with you how to create this bag with an envelope I received several comments on my mini album video on this I really like this I actually purchased this at a local antique store and I wish they had more um, unfortunately they only just had a set of four um, available at the time and but this is really easy to make and that's what I'm going to share with you in this video today this is using some really thin linen material and just a regular large envelope um, but I'm going to show you how you can create both. Um, so I'm just going to use some regular material that I had in hand. And so when you fold the material, you're going to fold it in half. And the measurements are going to be 6 inches going down and then 5 inches going across. Okay, that's the measurement of the material. Um, let's go ahead and invert this so I can show you, give you a better idea. Um, because it's not sewed, um, so you kind of get an idea of what it looks like when it's sewed. Okay, so once um, you got your material folded in half, you're going to open it up, okay, and the inside part is going to be facing you, and what you're going to do is you're going to take the top part of the material and you're going to fold it about a quarter of an inch down but before you do that you want to place your twine inside um, it's up to you how long you want the twine I didn't really measure this one but um, you just place it in like so and then you're going to um, fold down the flap like this okay and once you do that then you're going to get your sewing machine and you're going to sew all the way across to the very end. Okay, so once that is sewed, then you're going to fold it again in half. So let's fold this in half. Okay, so it looks like this. So you've got the two strings hanging out like so. Okay, and then you're going to sew all the way down this way. Okay? So it kind of looks like this. See how it's sewed up here? And then it has the two strings right here. And then they sewed it down here. Okay? So once you do that, go ahead and set it aside. Now to create the envelope, I just made my own envelope. What we're going to do is take some regular cardstock or, you know, whatever you want to use, design paper, and it measures 9 by 8. Okay, this is 9 going down, this is 8 going across. And I use my ScorePal. If you don't have a ScorePal, I know there's a Martha Stewart scoreboard, or you could just use your trimmer and use your bone folder. Um, so basically, on the 8-inch side, you're going to score it at 2 inches and then score it at 6 inches, okay? And then when you turn it over to the 9 inch side, you're going to score it at, the left side is you're going to score it at a half an inch, and then you're going to flip it over, and then you're going to score it at one and a half inch, okay? And then once you do that, you're going to fold all your, um, score um, lines and of course you're going to have this piece down here which I already cut off so you'll cut that out you'll cut this piece out the top part you'll cut that piece out and then you'll cut this piece out so it'll, it should look like this and what I did was I took my um, corner round punch and then I punched the bottom like here and then I also punched the top up here now if you want this more rounded you can create that too as well, um, or you could do this. And to get this right here, I just took my scissors and then I just, you know, I just kind of eyeballed it and then I just cut it here and then cut it here to where it looked like that. Okay? Now then you're going to go ahead and take um, your sticky tape and adhere it all the way down and then adhere it to the bottom here and it should look like this. Okay, so you got your envelope. Now you're going to take your envelope and get your material. 
and then you're going to place the envelope inside the pocket okay because you've already created a, a half somewhat pocket here and then you're going to line it and then you're going to make sure the envelope matches the bottom of the material okay now when you sew it down okay because you're going to sew it across from left to right or right to left make sure when you sew it that you're sewing in the middle of this um, half inch um, piece right here okay so it's going to be sewed down like that so it looks like this okay so that's what it looks like and you could see here that it was sewed in the middle of that um, bottom flap okay so once you do that then your um, pocket envelope should look like this this is what you should get exactly like this and then once that's done you're going to go ahead and invert it um, the pocket here and let's just do this okay so then it looks like this okay you see how they did it halfway onto that line so it looks like that and so this is what you should get um, by the time you're done and then like what I did in the video in the, on the mini album I just basically folded this in half so it looks like um, the part where it says letter inside um, shows there or you know you if you have a stamp that says that that's you know that's really neat and you could put whatever stamp I know there's a postage stamp out there and um, you could fold that in half and then just place the bag and add this to your mini page or if you want you can fold this over like this and tie this and decorate the front and this can make a really cute favor you could do so many things with um, this project here it's a really cute um, idea and so I hope that um, helps and I hope you give it a try it's, it's really fun and again you can use different materials um, different papers, different design papers, and um, create a really nice um, embellishment to your mini pages. So give it a try. Thanks, everyone, for watching. Bye.